when's the last time you took a turkey and and carved its head off with a butter knife? Come on. Cook the turkey. Let's see. That music is starting to get on my fucking nerves. Here, hold on a sec. Let me, let me put on some better music. And as you can see, the millions of programs that I have opened. Yes, it's Vista. Shut the hell up. Was there a way to mute this or anything? I mean, okay, okay. Uh, what can we do here? We have Cheetah Men. We have, uh... Here we go. This will work. That's right. That might work. Alright, let's see here. Sorry for this one. You know what? Why don't I just do this? Why don't I just mute it? <laughs> Where the hell's the volume center? There is no volume center. Well, they were right. Vista sucks. And look at that! A delicious turkey dinner for you all. Entrails and all sticking out of it. If you cook like that, then you need to kill yourselves. Turkeys are drugged so that they are fattened. That's where all the flavor comes from, bitches. Make the giblet gravy. Okay, I've never made giblet gravy before in my life. What exactly are they trying to accomplish here? And quit staring at me, you fucking whore. What are they trying to accomplish here? Seriously, it's it's practically telling me how to cook a turkey. What exact? This is like a step-by-step -step instruction booklet on how to cook a turkey. It's not accomplishing anything. Okay, more butter knife carving here. A am I the only one who finds it creepy that the turkey's still staring at me? Surprisingly, I'm doing a little better job than... Ugh. Saute the body parts. Blood and all. Wouldn't you love to make your turkey out of... Once again, how is making gravy meaner than mama? Strain the gravy. <laughs> it doesn't that look delicious, kids? Fucking feet and bones and entrails and shit. Oh, come on. Mm-mm, doesn't that look nutritious? <laughs> So I would love to have a banner on my webpage. Okay, what the fuck just <laughs> happened here? Apparently killing animals indiscriminately gives you a change of heart. Okay, that makes sense. Mama loves animals and doesn't that look like a delicious lump of dog shit? Oh wait, it's tofu. Oh god. <laughs> okay. Darkness is just one thing. I mean, you don't like tofu, but it absorbs the flavors of what you cook it with, so it's not that bad. I've had it in stir-fry. But doesn't that look like a dull... Oh, yeah. Masturbate the tofu. Okay. Better than my... Oh, my God. That smile's the creepiest thing ever. 
Shape the tofu turkey. Because we all know this is better than real turkey. Hooray! We've made a delicious lump of dog shit. Base the tofu turkey. You know what? Darkness was right. These are easier games. Doesn't that look delicious, kids? Turkeys have unique per- oh, here we go, more of the bullshit. Have unique personalities, just like dogs and cats. Yes, because they're fucking animals. <laughs> People who live with turkeys, the animal- oh my god, can we just shut this shit off, please? Delicious turkey free recipes? I don't think so. What the fuck is this? Because of you! You know, a minute ago, you, a minute ago she was slaughtering turkeys, now she's hugging them. What the hell? You know, I don't know what's creepier, the fact that you just slaughtered a bunch of turkeys, or this picture right here. L waving her dumbass head back and forth with her sparkly eyes and the turkey just staring into your soul. Take a pledge to be veg. How about go fuck yourself, PETA? Oh my god. What have I gotten myself into? <laughs> Oh my god, this is... this is Jesus. Ugh. I mean, this isn't Jesus, this is just like... Why did I play this game? <laughs> Look, people. I don't care if you're vegetarian, I don't care if you're not. I... If you support PETA, that's fine, but you know what? Don't fucking force it on us, okay? This isn't helping anything. The games like this isn't helping anything. I mean, uh, what? and what if you released these turkeys and shit into the wild? Uh, these domestic turkeys that were factory raised? What do you think's gonna happen? They're going to die. If you release chickens into the wild, they're going to die, okay? Uh, okay, I have a challenge to PETA. PETA, I challenge you to... Bust in a factory, take these chickens, and release them into the wild. Wait one week, return to that place you released them, and see how many are left standing. I think you will find it that, um, none of them will be left standing, so. On behalf of Big Al Rants, YouTube, Darkness the Curse, and everyone else, this is Big Al, over and out.